Hey guys, Merry Christmas and a very happy new year to you and all yours. I hope you're doing well. This is a final end of the year update for the Men's Tribe and uh, I am so thankful for each and every one of you watching this video and also all of you who are coming to Men's Breakfast, came to the shooting event, fishing, uh, hunt, uh, hunting. We haven't done hunting except some of you doing it secretly without inviting me, but hey, we can fix this next year. Listen, quick update for you guys. This uh, this Sunday, please come to church and bring $10 so we can buy your own Christmas gift from me. Ha! Yes, that was the uh, that was supposed to happen this past Sunday. We changed plans on the go <clears throat> and um, I still have the gift though. This is a very good read that I would like for us to start the year together with a book. Obviously, you can read it uh, all throughout the year. Uh, the book is called uh, Chasing Wisdom from a very dear and close friend of mine, Pastor Daniel Grothy from New Life Church in Colorado Springs. He wrote the book, um, I think, two years ago. It came out earlier this year. don't remember. Excellent read, excellent book about chasing wisdom. And when you think about it, how do we live our lives? Are we, uh, sure, educated, smarter, all this, but being educated and knowing stuff doesn't necessarily make me wise. I want to chase wisdom. And the wisdom in the Bible starts with the fear of the Lord. And so, um, Proverbs 3, read it for yourselves. But how do we get wisdom? How do we search for wisdom? Daniel unpacks it in a beautiful way, breaks it down in several chapters. I'm going to have a short plug-in for the book on Sunday, but I want to give you a heads up. If you're coming to church this Sunday, bring $10 cash. We'll take credit cards too, but we'd like to start the year together reading through this book and as we, as we dive into 2022. I also hope to see you at our first men's tribe breakfast, <laughs> except this time it's going to be coffee only. Yes, our first breakfast, uh, men's breakfast, falls on January 8th, Saturday. But we're also starting the 21 days of prayer and fast as a church. So we'll just have coffee or bring your own coffee, bring your own tea. And this time we're going to meet upstairs in the children's chapel. So come in through the office doors and let's meet in the chapel 7.30, January 8th. We're going to announce this as well this coming Sunday, give you a chance to sign up on the connection cards. And so if you don't make this this coming Sunday to grab your book, I hope to see you on Saturday, January 8th at the um, men's uh, breakfast time. We're going to take that time to pray, fellowship, talk a little bit about future plans and uh, pray for each other, pray for our church, pray for our families. And um, that's how we're going to start the year again. You can grab your copy of that book on January 8th or your last chance is going to be on January 9th. My birthday um, will give you a chance to grab your copy of the book on January 9th as well. So hope you guys have a wonderful uh, uh, welcoming, celebrating the 2022. I love spending my life and sharing life with you guys. God's blessings. Blessings to you and your families. I call you blessed. And um, talk to you soon. Hey, love you guys. Take care. Bye.